so much has happened in my personal life anyway. I met my wife at uni when I was doing my physio degree. She's a physio as well. Her name's Terry. My daughter, Jess, she's four. And Brody, he was born in kind of October 2017. He was born while I was studying, which ch changed the amount of work or when I was able to do work. It's impacted mostly on, on, on my wife, who's had to put up with me disappearing off upstairs straight after work for a couple of hours. She's been able to see the benefits it's had on my career, because the benefits it's had on my career has been massive, really. When I first started studying professional development at Manchester Met, I felt nervous because there were a lot of people on the course who were more experienced physios than me. Certainly, contrasting me then with me now, I feel very comfortable in my clinical role, and I have Manchester Met to thank for that. One of the things that I'd taken from those professional development modules was the importance of being able to kind of do something and measure its effect, and then build a service that's targeted to addressing those specific issues to this trust rather than being quite generic about it and being able to then measure that impact as well. I think that was important in why me for this job. And I think that in general terms, level of patient care is much higher, is much better. And specifically, I think that managing more complex kind of shoulder problems, which previously I hate shoulders, hate shoulders. But if someone comes in with a shoulder problem now, I'm like, all right, get in, this is gonna be good. The teaching we had at Manchester Met was really good. It certainly encouraged me to think a lot more for myself and certainly trust my judgment. It has been hard work, but it's been worth the hard work. It's been worth the challenges and the, and the balance with kind of family life. It's made me better at what I do. It made us a lot more confident in what I do. Definitely, I'm a much, much better clinician than I was. 